So now, how many generations of James have been farming potatoes? Well, six of them. Six, six generations. generations. Yes. Wow. Both uh, and uh, nearly that many on uh, both sides, but my mother's side too. They uh, been growing the potatoes for a long time. Farmers are usually the first to embrace technology. There are a lot of things farmers don't want to change. There's a lot of things that farmers are pretty happy with the way they are. But every time something comes along that helps you farm better, I see most farmers standing in line to, to get their hands on it and get involved with it. Yeah, yep, that's right. Uh, I know it's, uh, we can do a lot more using a lot less, where it's fuel, uh, chemicals, et cetera. Each year it seems to be better, better for the environment, and efficient. And so that's, that's, I don't know how it can keep going, but every year there, there's improvements. Mr. Rubin, I, I know you've got a love for this land. Uh, you, you probably love this land about as much as you love your family. Tell me about, tell me about stewardship and in your life, the practice of it. Uh, well, we, I learned early on uh, from uh, my father that uh, you take care of the land and it'll uh, <clears throat> help you uh, take care of you. So we've always uh, worked on uh, good drainage, good uh, uh, rotation for whatever crop we did. And uh, I remember a lot of summers uh, for some of the crops before we had chemicals, you had to pull the weeds and get the grass out of the crop. So that was ongoing. You knew you were going to do that uh, for a month or so during the summer. Uh, if you weren't doing potatoes at the time. So stewardship was added to make sure that uh, the uh, whoever came behind you was added. Um, Eric, I'm sure they started drilling that into you at an yes, early sir. age. Yes, sir. Same thing. Tell me what you saw through your eyes looking in, at Daddy and following in his footsteps about how you take care of the land, how you treat the farm, well, how he, you approach things. Yeah. He, he's got big shoes to fill. I don't know if I can do that, but I'm gonna try. But um, no, nah, he, he same same as his dad. He you know take care of everything, and it'll take care of you.